All right, moms and dads, you ever wonder why we talk about these scans all the time and what those are all about? While traditional medicine relies primarily on symptoms and looks for obvious pathology on standard exams like blood work, MRIs, EEGs, EKGs, we use an incredible piece of technology called an Insight Nervous System Scanner that accurately assesses the health and the function, the health and the function of the central nervous system. When we get into things like technology and neurology, Many of us can get overwhelmed and confused quite quickly, but that's the beauty and most importantly the practicality of our insight scanning technology. It's super simple and easy to understand. So this video will help you do just that, understand what we're talking about when we talk about our skins. So parents, moms and dads who aren't just looking for an alternative, but who are looking for the root cause of their child's struggles and symptoms, this video is made specifically for you. Watch to the end. The most critical system that determines whether your child and your entire family for that matter is healthy or not is truly the central nervous system, or just the nervous system for short. It's made up of three divisions, sensory, autonomic, which I talk about to crazy ends, and motor, which work together to coordinate every internal function with every movement and with every thought, every emotion, every behavior, every cognitive function, it's important. It's the air traffic controller for the entire human experience. So we will just get a little tad bit nerdy in this video, but with the purpose to give you science answers and help that you are looking for. I once had a mom sit across from me when we were going over her scans, or her child's scans, stop mid-sentence and say, I can't believe the scan is showing me exactly what my child and I have been experiencing for these last three years with his focus and attention struggles. I feel like I could have predicted this exact same result. And this mom couldn't have been closer to the truth. In honesty, most parents, if they knew about the measurements of the insight scans beforehand, could very accurately predict where stress would show up in their child. We call it a mom's intuitive nature. These insight scans are incredibly accurate in helping address and find the root cause of children's or kiddos' problems. I had a brand new super dude in the office today, uh, this afternoon actually, named Gage. And as I'm going through his scans, mom smiles with a big sigh of relief and says, it all just makes too much sense. And we see this all the time. I jokingly tell her that we can even predict what the scans will look like just coming off of the kiddo's story or in reverse. We can take a look at a kiddo's scans and the makeup tell you what their story was like. That's how detailed that they are. That's how much in-depth uh, information they give us. Traditional medicine, again, focuses on symptoms and obvious pathology. We use insight scans to assess the health of the central nervous system and how it's functioning. This looks at how excuse me, this looks at health through a different lens to find the root cause of the system, uh, in the system through the symptoms or the struggles that the kiddo is having. These scans look intricately at the central nervous system, the CNS, which includes the brain and the spinal cord, and it's crucial for co coordinating all internal body functions, movements, thoughts, emotions, behaviors, cognitive functions, everything. An extension of the central nervous system is the autonomic nervous system. This controls key building functions like eating, sleeping, pooping, and moving, quite important for your kiddos. Additionally, the nervous system has sensory and motor nerves that combine these systems to communicate information between the body and the brain and the brain and the body. I did that backwards, but you get the idea. The nervous system is truly the master control system of the body. Dr. Bruce Lipton puts it this way, the function of the nervous system is to perceive the environment and coordinate the function of all other cells. It's as simple as that. It's that important. The insight scans are all about finding, tracking, and understanding if subluxation and dysautonomia, two nerdy words that mean communication between the master control center, the brain, and the nervous system, and the body, if these communications or lack of communications are present. And if they are, we need to know two things about them how significant or severe, mild, moderate, severe, intensive, and where within the neurospinal system are the things primarily located, the tracking and the targeting that I'm talking about. When too much tension and too much stress are stuck in one specific area of the neurospinal system, it helps us better understand why certain symptoms and certain conditions may be present. Think of the neurospinal system as the fuse box in your home. While our nervous system is quite a bit more intricate and complex than that, at its core, many of the sensory and motor nerves function similarly. In our office, we use the NeuroFuse chart, it's over there, we use the NeuroFuse chart to help better locate and track where and what kind of trouble the subluxation and that dysautonomia, the uh, disconnection, the dysregulation, the dysfunction, um, track where and what it may be causing. 
There are three different types of scans to assess the central nervous system and the stress coming in from the environment. As we talk through these three scans, let's look at examples of each at the same time to see how truly impactful these scans can be to the, see the root cause of health struggles. So we're going to use Cassie's. Cassie doesn't care. She's well adjusted. Her scans are pretty good actually. Neurothermal, not actually, of course she's well adjusted. Neurothermal scans help us assess the effects of subluxation and dysautonomia on the digestive system, the immune system, the hormones, and more. That is this one and this one. It looks at the autonomic functions of the body and how these bodily systems, organs and glands communicate neurologically with the brain. Our EMG scans, our neurospinal EMG scans are crucial for investigating conditions like autism, ADHD, anxiety, which are rooted in neuromotor system challenges. That's this guy. And when we see that on those types of cases, that autism, ADHD, and anxiety, these scans, the energy is through the roof. It's all over the place. This scan looks at the energy that's coming in from the body and travels upwards to the brain, specifically the cerebellum and the motor center of the brain. Too much energy or unorganized confusing energy in the body can directly overwhelm these motor centers, triggering a fight or flight response in the brain's other processing zones. So when we see chaos on these scans, we can directly relate it to your child like having a meltdown and then not regulating, having the trouble sitting and focusing, ADD, uh, autism spectrum, um, sensory processing disorders. We see a lot of that measured with this EMG. HRV scans now provide a broader picture of neurological health and adaptability. These indicate if the autonomic nervous system is healthy or stressed. These are Cassie's. She's about dead center in the green, especially or exactly where I expect her to be. She's doing awesome. It shows the momentum we have and can give us insight into how long the nervous system has been struggling and how efficient it is in the moment. Two key things uh, with kids that are having a tough time communicating about their health, their feelings, their challenges, everything that's going on. So again, where we're having trouble, are we stressed, are we balanced, and um, how long the stress has been there? How, how worn out, how tired is the body? Okay, like I said, two key things the kids have trouble communicating their health with, but we can show that through our scans. In our office, we will take you through each scan individually. Perhaps the most important aspect of the Insight scans is being able to pull all the pieces of the puzzle together and get a full picture of what's going on in your child's nervous system and their overall health. The insight scans do exactly what they're named for. They give us insight and understanding of the most crucial aspect of your child's health in ways that no other health practitioner can. The nervous system truly is the mom of the entire body, keeping everything and everyone on track at all times. Dads, you talk about a little bit too, but let's be honest, not as much as moms. And just like quite a few moms, it can get wound up and worn out, the nervous system I mean. But it truly doesn't have to be that way. We take these insight scans put together a fully personalized, customized care plan for you. And with each adjustment during that restoration or wellness care plan, you'll see the stuck stress and stuck tension leave your child's body, leave your body, leave mom's body, leave dad's body, leave everybody's body. The calm, the relaxation, and the healing capacity then start to kick in. So any questions about our insight scans, direct message, email, comment, call, um, get yourself on the schedule. Share this information with other Facebook mom groups and friends and family and other people who need to see this. Um, like I said, we want to help as many people as we can. Uh, this is how, and I know if there's one of you out there that can use this information, there's literally, literally hundreds and thousands. So thank you.